this is a little girl, no musical background in our family whatsoever. She's learned all this music and run this thing right by herself. And, uh, I think you've done a pretty good job in 20 years. When I look up and I see this poster, it says four number one songs. Four number one <laughs> national charts. That's pretty good for anybody. And she was selected at one time as a traditional female bluegrass singer of the year. So here we go, Lorraine Jordan and Carolina Road. <laughs> Oh, oh, oh. 
They call it bluegrass. Born in Kentucky, when it was raised in Caroline. The sound of bluegrass came from the five string. Pick the banjo one more time. You know Bill Monroe came down from Charlotte in the fall of '45. Met Mr. Scruggs from out in Shelby, and bluegrass music came alive. They call it bluegrass, born in Kentucky, when he was raised in Carolina. The sound of bluegrass came from the five string. Pick the banjo one more time. And they tried to sound like her. From that day on, was the birth of bluegrass and the sound we know that shook the world. They called it bluegrass, born in Kentucky, but it was raised in Carolina. The sound of bluegrass came from the five string. Pick the banjo one more time. this banjo in tune with the keys. I hope they'll hold with we'll uh, Earl Scruggs tune one he wrote called uh, Earl's Breakdown. Colorado and the people that I met there were 
so kind I fell in love with the girl just north of Boulder And I told her someday she would be my own And I got this restless feeling in my heart and on my mind And I knew that I must be a moving on Now the sun is going down over the Rockies It's almost tomorrow, my friend The beauty of these mountains cannot change the way I feel Homesick for the Blue Ridge once again
and the left your so much, so much fun. So my friends, if you desire, you may join the heavenly choir, heavenly choir and rejoice with him free from every sin when he sets this world on fire. Tonight. We certainly appreciate you. 
We're going to get out and speak and shake and howdy to everybody. And I uh, wish the birthday people a special happy birthday. Jared, I'm going to come over there to see you too, buddy. Anyway, folks, uh, we appreciate everybody coming. We'll get back to the second set. We'll have some more fun with you. If some of your songs got left off the first set, we'll get them to the second set. Don't forget our sales table over here to the right. We'd love for you to take our new gospel song CD home with you if you don't have it. On behalf of Ben Green on the five string, Alan Dyer with singing lead, Mr. Kevin Lamb back there on the bass, Randy Graham over here on the guitar, and also Matthew Hooper on the fiddle. I'm the rain, and you're at the rains in Garner. Thank you, everybody. Going, going up, I'm going way up just to see my Savior there. Going, going up, I'm going way up, let him free my soul from hell. Give it up for Lorraine Jordan and Carolina Road. Mighty fine. Again, live, Friday night style, live at Lorraine's, y'all. Here at Garner, North Carolina is where we are, Lorraine's Coffee and Cafe. We welcome you back to the second half of our show tonight. thinking about my little town of Vanceboro, North Carolina. If you see a racehorse running through the blue grass, you hear a banjo ringing in the heat. You're 
Milwaukee where the golden vine is blooming. And you come up on a big old moonshine steel. That's Kentucky, it's the homeland of the bride. That's Kentucky, can be all your heart desires. And a moon and old Abe Lincoln, not to mention Bill Monroe. That's Kentucky, that's Kentucky, don't you know?
Oh, 
the world and I long to hold you close to me. But by tomorrow you'll be gone and I'll still be here all alone dreaming of you, my Molly Rose. Thank you. 
this out about this song while we're getting ready. Um, this song is, was written by a guy named Don Reno, who was a great first generation banjo player. He wrote a lot of bluegrass classics and uh, he played a different style. All banjo players want to have their own identity and he played a lot with his thumb. And uh, there's not a lot of accomplished banjo players that play a lot of Don Reno stuff just because it's so hard, but Garrett uh, does a great job on it. So just, just pay attention to that.
Okay, now your dad said you were going to talk on the stage tonight, so go ahead and tell him about who you are and how old you are and where you're from and everything. <laughs> Jojo, my name is Brandy Murphy. I'm from Richlands, North Carolina, and I'm going to play mandolin. How about that Richlands, North Carolina, folks? Isn't that something? Isn't that something? And uh, she's, uh, all the whole family plays. They're called Billy and the Kids. And sometimes we uh, get them up here and let them, let them front us. And uh, next time they're coming, maybe when Garrett's playing, maybe we can get them to front us. Or we'll check and see when their next availability is. But their, their dad and... Uh, the brothers and JoJo all played, and they played the Christmas in the Smokies this year, didn't you? Yes. Okay, and that was a lot of fun. All right, Matthew, uh, we're going to let you do uh, Jerusalem Fridge with JoJo, okay? <laughs> all right, Wayne, it's up to you. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. 
I've called Jarek to come up now. My friend, I told you about my friend who had the brain surgery, and uh, he wanted to come see Lorraine uh, once he recovered. And, and uh, he's going to come up here. My dad's going to come up here. And uh, uh, I, I asked Jarek. Jarek and my dad did this on the stage uh, in Burlington. Would you make welcome my little friend, Jarek? Come on up, Jarek. I'll let you talk about it. I was five years old. And Lorraine's dad gave me the microphone, and I got to sing the national anthem and the and the pledge of allegiance in front of everybody. And right now we're going to do the pledge of allegiance. So, I think I think we need to honor America. We've got we've got some times we got to be nervous about right now, and we need to honor our veterans and uh, honor our military. So if you can, if you can't, we understand. But if you can, please stand. Uh, for the Pledge of Allegiance, and then we're going to do some military songs in honor of the military. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the poem which is in one nation under God and the Christian and justice for all. I'm gonna talk to you some. Come, talk back to me, okay? So you, that was a scary surgery you had, wasn't it? Yes, it was scary. Talking this right here. It was scary, but I, I had a lot of doctor that was really nice, really nice. Everybody took care of you. Yes. And did I send you some surprises? Yes. <laughs> he's got some on right now, but uh. He's a, he's a wonderful fellow, and I'm so glad that he wanted to come see me. I hadn't seen him in years, and it's so special to get to see him. That's Jared, everybody. Okay, folks. Make welcome, my father. This is one of the things that we do when we're on tour, and uh, the people seem to like it, so I thought we'd do it tonight. We had such a good crowd here tonight. But we're going to honor all of our military. And as we call out your branch, please stand. So uh, we get Ben Green over here. He does a miraculous job on the banjo on this thing. So uh, we'll get it going and let her rip, Ben. All righty. The United States Marine Corps. Deborah, would you give them a patriotic CD, please, when we have some back there? The old Lelotex, the ones we depend on all the time for the grunt work. And now we come to my branch of service, the United States Army. coming by and said, gosh, I wish I was up there, but we sure were glad they were there. The United States Air Force. We got a lady. that's surrounded by oceans. So we had to have someone to protect our shores. So who do we call on? The United States Navy, Coast Guard, and Merchant Marine. That's my neighbor right there.
that's the reason that we are here tonight, because we had these branches of service to protect us all of our lives. So thank God for the four branches of service, and thank God for the United States of America. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. We appreciate that. Been doing that one a long time, haven't we, Mr. Benny Green? Yeah, buddy. Yes, we have. <laughs> well, let's see now. We did Thus Kentucky. And we did, yep, we got a couple. Let's do another number one song for, for the folks. You might have heard this one. This, uh, this song, uh, uh, it was during the pandemic year, and nobody was out playing, and we weren't smart like Tim Raven, who waited and put his CD out after the pandemic. <laughs> we went ahead and put ours out, and, of course, we weren't out there playing, nobody to buy the CD. So the only people that actually had the, the CD were the, were the DJs, and the only way you could hear the new music was the radio. And if you want to hear some really good new music, turn to Highway 40 Bluegrass Tuesdays from 4 to 7 with Mr. Doug Whitley right there. He's got a great, great radio. All right, here it is, Bill Monroe's Old Mandolin. <laughs> But I 
can go to them. So many precious friends and many loved ones too are waiting now for me somewhere beyond the blue since Jesus called them home to live up there with him I cannot bring them back but I can go to I weep for friends gone on, but I'll weep for them no more. They're resting now in peace on God's They're satisfied of there where everything is good. I cannot bring them back. I would not if I could. So many are waiting now for me somewhere beyond the blue since Jesus called them home to live up there with him I cannot bring them back but I can go to them. No, I cannot bring them back. But I can go to song that I wrote. Everybody has their favorite Bible lesson. Mine was Noah's Ark, of course. <laughs> so you might have yours. Listen to the song and see if you hear yours. Here's the song's number one on the gospel charts a few weeks ago, and it stayed up there for about three weeks. Lessons of the Book. Have you heard about the terrible flood to give 
giving of the Savior's blood, singing of the angel band out amongst the promised land. Do you know about my Jesus and the many steps he took? Have you been told the great, great stories? Do you know, know the lessons of the book? holy throne do you know about my jesus and the many steps he took have you been told the great great stories do you know know the lessons of the book do you know know the lessons of the book There'll be an article coming out in the Bluegrass Unlimited about this band and this place in April. So you'll get to see, you'll get to hear about this band and this place a little bit. And you'll, you'll get to know about what we believe in and what we stand for. And we are a traditional band and uh, we believe in keeping it alive, traditional style. Don't care if they close it all down, we're going to still be playing that to the end. Right there, Mr. Ben Green is your featured artist for the April Bluegrass Unlimited magazine this month. How about that? Here it is, folks. Why can't bluegrass just be true grass again? One, two. Well, old Cord had it right. There's the hat. I crime down on the road. They murdered country music, tore out its heart and soul. Now they're trying to kill the grass, handed down by Bill Monroe. Maybe someday they'll find their way to just leave us alone. Well, I recall the times when we heard sweet harmony. They're still there somewhere, but not as much as there should be. Now some are holding on to the way it used to be. And if our heroes could come back home, there'd be a change we sure be. I'm long for those old fiddles, a guitar and mandolin with a banjo. Hear no bass walking in. Now the tearing down tradition, Lord, it feels just like a sin. Why can't blue grass just be true grass again? We're still out there on the road Laying down that true grass sound And we still do what we do But there's less of us around Now we're fighting every day To keep blue grass alive And if we're true to our roots Well, our music might survive I long for those old fiddles, a guitar and banjolin, with a banjo, a dobro, and an old bass walking in. Now the tearing down tradition, Lord, it feels just like a scene. Why can't bluegrass just be true grass again?
All aboard! It's Lorraine Jordan and Carolina Road. My goodness. We got to get out of here, y'all. But thank you all for being here again. Another, it's Friday night live at Lorraine's, y'all. And good night.